Hi guys! Hey, you need to stop complaining. <laughs> Hi, we are here. Can you imagine you've driven for four minutes, four minutes just to come and take pictures? Of course. We are at the Las Vegas sign. A very tiny and sign. And you know what? I cannot find you where you are. You have to drive to it. I because uh, this is one of the things you want to do. When you come to Vegas, you come to the last and Vegas sign. And people are queuing. There is a queue. Just there is a long line. We have really enjoyed our. St oh, let me move out of the way. Nancy, are you excited? You look tired. <laughs> Nancy looks like she, she wants to get home, and she she looks like she's ready for to go to back to bed. <laughs> oh my God, we've had an amazing time in Vegas, and you can tell. The first day we were so excited now we are like looking all tired i'll show you guys if i first this way you'll be able to see where the sign is you can see the truck food food truck right there and also some other vendors vendors selling food oh coconut water maji amanazi hello Oh, you want to take a picture? I don't want to take a picture. No, I'm good. I'm taking a video. <laughs> no, Michael Jackson. Nancy. Nancy. Oh, they take cards too. Yeah. How much? <laughs> yeah, by the way, just swap your card. Nibiashara. Who pick my picture? Just taking pictures with them, you, you pay. And they charge twenty dollars. We asked, you know, those ladies who dress up all oh, crazy. We asked one of them. They say they charge twenty dollars. There's a private, uh, private jet airport here. <laughs> Did I? Yeah. You can see, guys. So we're gonna line up. Imagine all this line just to take a picture on the Las Vegas side. Oh, but they. And then later on, we're gonna go to Hoover Dam and take more uh, pictures at Hoover Dam just to make sure we are enjoying the whole experience. If you don't wanna line up, if you line up, you cut a line. If I want to cut a line, it just mama up, I take a picture with the sign because it's a long line. See, guys. Yeah, and people here, they are very disciplined, but we still find some people going all cuckoo, cuckoos. <laughs> so guys, check out that private, all those private jets. Private jets, what to work on Amandegi, America. Hmm? I tell you, that's how the whole place looks like. So I'm going to join the group and line up and then take pictures. So if you come, if you have never been to Las Vegas, this is where, if you ever make it here, this is where you're going to take your pictures at the Las Vegas site. It's one of the tourist attractions. Things to do. And now it's time to eat the fruit. Looks good. This reminds me of home. <laughs> Kwa vibanda. Mm? Yeah. And you know what? In Vegas, when you get married, you come and take pictures here too. Yeah, that beautiful bride, she just got married and now she wants pictures at the Las Vegas sign. You can see. And also when you walk on the strip, you see, you find a lot of uh, a lot of people after their wedding or bride to be stuff like that things like that and you know walking on the street and taking the pictures and enjoying their day but the funny part is you always find you always see those brides walking in their wedding gowns so tired you know like after the walk so I mean after walking wearing the gown 
gosh so so tired and exhausted my god i don't think i would want to do that after my wedding i want to take a limo and go home or just take a regular car whatever car it is but not walk on the street so we decided to stop at this beautiful location and have a uh, breakfast we'll just do dennis again yesterday we did dennis and we're gonna do dennis again i love dennis i don't know for some reason why i always La, prefer Dennis for breakfast uh, yeah so we are going to eat breakfast I feel like this place is hotter than Arizona I don't know why <laughs> I know we have the same weather but whoa man it's hot all right my breakfast is here and I tell you what it took forever but I still enjoy that Eunice's breakfast and that Nancy's breakfast what We are driving, we go by that bridge over on top of Perfect, it. Perfect, huh? Maybe I'm saying it wrong, but that's the name, Hoover Dam. Hoover Dam. All right, guys, here we are at the famous Hoover Dam. Oh my God, if you fear heights, God, my goodness. I'm just looking down and I feel like I'm getting dizzy already because I fear heights. And this dam is just like, all the way down i don't know how many feet down but it's deep so you can feel <laughs> when you look down you feel kind of ish ish i tell you 
Eunice, do you feel height? How do you feel? Oh, yes. Right now, I can't even down here. <laughs> it's making you feel some type of way. Right. Yeah. And also, you can get more information about the dam. Uh, you know, because there are, there are some tour guides here. But I'm not. we are not going to take a tour guide. But all I can tell you is, if you look up on Google, it will tell you more about the Hoover Dam. Hoover Dam in Nevada. Okay, that's the beauty. You look like you're ready for a picture. <laughs> Unis and photos, she loves pictures. So right now she's gonna take pictures of me too, here. Wow, guys, look at the dam from this angle. Nima, Nima, you know, in a Kwanga, very, it's very deep down there. It looks like all green, right? So, yeah, that's how it looks like from this angle. <sighs> you know what, guys, the reason I'm telling you to. <laughs> to google and learn more about the dam because i don't think i can give you about a lot about this dam like a lot of information but i can tell you that that's something you want to see when you come to nevada okay so we're crossing over for me to show you the other side look at this this is more wider so from this angle this is more wider you know, you need the best thing to do. You get a tour guide so that you can get you can all the information. information about this place. And that's why I'm telling my YouTube people for today <laughs> on this video, I'm not going to give them a whole lot and, of and information because I don't know boat. so much. Yeah, the yeah, these boats, yeah, they're doing boat rides here. And I don't know how deep it, this de it dam be is. Deep enough. I believe so. I don't know why the water is green. Can you tell it's just as green? I, I don't know. It's treated. If you don't know what it is, but yeah, I think. But you know what? I think at some point, when it rains so bad, I think it this water up, goes yeah, up. up. You to, can to tell. The level of yeah, the you can too. tell the water level. It goes up and down. I mm. believe when it's like really raining, because maybe this water comes from um, so different the, sources. Some, yeah. I don't know that's why i said i'm sorry guys if you're watching this video you have to you have to look up on on google about hoover dam and it'll give you more information but it's one of the things you want to see when you come but this is really famous this is in nevada so you can see there are so many people they come here so many tourists they come here to see the dam yeah so this is not something that is just at the evo too you know it's a uh, one of the tourist attractions in Nevada. All right, I'll show you guys my outfit of the day. Are you recording, Eunice? Yes, I'm recording, <laughs> so this, be careful. This girl, which I, I was talking for 15 minutes, and the whole time she was like, I'm sorry, I wasn't recording. <laughs> I'm teaching her to be a YouTuber, so my gosh, this place is I'm in good. training, I guys. the best time to come here is when the sun is not too hot. Because when it's too hot like now, you actually, won't enjoy. Right now it's not even it's bad. Imagine when it's 170. I don't think degrees. there is anybody who can come and. No, there is. They, the they last do. Time I came here, the sun was like almost 120. It and there were so people. Yeah. No, I can't. Yeah. Right yeah. now it's very hot. So you know what? We're gonna go take pictures over there. Betty, where it says Hoover Dam. Fish. The maki. I don't want to lose my glasses. <laughs> is that a fish? Yes. So that means the water is that clear? Yeah, and it's not so deep because I can see like... Oh, you can see. Over here, it's not as deep as... Hey, I don't want to lose my glasses. This Kai Magoko Nikoliko Yunisi. Oh, you you have good eyes. Can you imagine that she can see the fish? The fish is na kedu kena maizo. Ni rona ke kanya. Ni kwada ko rusu ba sisi oba. Edrona. Ni rona. Ah, ni meona by the way. Ni meona, but ni deep. I just don't wanna. It's so deep. Yeah, now go pa ni si angushe miwani uko ndani. Oh my god. You don't wanna 
I have my glasses. They are like right over there. Mm. Right in our creature that has very bright eyes. Guy, yeah, this you can see there. Hey, you need. Ata unani, ata unani ni, unani chaza ha. Kwa hivyo we can do fishing. Oh, tuna block njia. So we can do fishing. That's what she said. I wouldn't eat the fish though because it's all the water is green. So if you eat the fish from here, you'll be eating some healthy green fish. Ha! Time to take photos. I wish life is always like this, oh, traveling and vlogging. You know what? I'm thinking, guys, I'm gonna start being a full time travel YouTuber and kind of, you know, vlogger. Yeah, somebody's calling you a full time vlogger, vlogger, ha, and be taking my trips. Now, the only thing is, you just give me a, an idea of where to take my babies. Should I be swallowing my babies or going traveling with them? Because if I become a full-time YouTuber, vlogger, like a travel YouTuber, yes. I don't think there's anything else to see other than the anti-traveling partner. What? What do you mean traveling partner? It's Betty, traveling buddy. Mwambi umepata travel buddy. You need sana hand wana beshte yake. Sorry for this. Who don't understand, understand so I hear you. This one say, who for dam spill my house? This dam has been here since 1931, I guess. Oh my gosh. Yeah, the heat. The heat, the heat, the heat. Let me flip the camera. But if you have company, oh my goodness, I had fun. Yeah, on the phone, what she's telling her friend. Oh my goodness, I had fun. Guys, guys, I don't know what those buildings are. And I don't know where this Hoover Dam supplies the heat, the electricity to, and who it supplies the electricity because I know this is like a, a, a whatever, what is it called? An energy whatever plant. Guy, I know those people who know more about this, this place that they, they're gonna throw stones at me, rocks at me, and be like, Barry, why are you showing the place if you don't have the information? But the thing is, I don't have to know everything, right? All I need to is to show you the pictures and for you to find out. Oh, I think this is towards more the parking space, the parking lot. And I don't think you can go over. I don't even think people can hike around here. Those rocks are pretty uh, dry and I don't think they're stable either. So chances of kind of uh, falling over, you know, like you don't want to do that. So this is more a parking space. So I'm going to go back this way because there's nothing much there. Yeah, I tell you, I don't want to hear anybody say, Betty, how come you're not giving us the whole information about who? But I told you I'm tired. Leave me alone. Google. <laughs> I love you so much my people you guys are awesome and thank you so much for watching my videos so what we're gonna do is because I've shown you Hoover Dam we're gonna be driving home now back home back to our home in um, Guy where, where is our home Phoenix we are going to drive back to Phoenix it will take us about four and a half hours or five back to Phoenix and that's pretty much it we're gonna do that's all we're gonna do when we go back to go back home and i miss my babies oh it's been two days and you know what i've done two weekends of back-to-back -back travel so nimefanya my travel zangu back to back for two weekends i've been gone i feel guilty i feel bad don't think i don't feel guilty i do leaving the babies with mom but the thing is uh, I'm so happy because mom was so understanding and she 
she was encouraged you know she encouraged me to go and have a take a break you know and enjoy myself and right now I can guarantee you I am gonna be like I don't think I'm gonna be taking another solo trip in a long like in a while I don't even think I'm gonna be taking another solo trip anyway that was like the only two weekends of solo trip for now because soon mom is gonna be going back to Kenya so anyway well I'm so thirsty I'm looking for somewhere I can drink some water or something oh. so guys we're gonna be driving back <laughs> over that bridge so I just wanted to, to give you a perfect view of it while I'm here I can zoom it in see how high it is and I can zoom it out like that and that's pretty much it about the dam yeah nice so if you come to Arizona or if you come to Nevada that's something you can make sure you remember put it on your bucket list yeah definitely for sure Oh, thank God the sun is, has gone down a little bit. I was getting a headache from that. Oh, wow. And look at the other side from here. Hey. Wow. Now, eh? Are they bathrooms? Oh, restrooms. Okay. We don't, I don't need a bath to use. Wow. Mataro a hair kariku. Hey, yeah, you can see cars parked there. Like there's a tunnel or something. Right there. Yeah? Oh, there's a tunnel there. Mm -hmm. and then they Going go where? Oh, wow. And... Guys, can you see the to tunnel? Be able to go in and out. Yeah, the engineers. And there's uh, a doorway. You see that over there? Yeah. Yeah, because they walk in there. Wow. All right. So that means that tunnel goes in the yeah. rocks. Wow. Yeah. And then that one, either way, they, they are able to go to True. the other side. Yeah. yeah. Oh my God. Now you can imagine if anything goes wrong, all this rock coming down or something. But you know, these people, they are very clever. This dam has been here for years, I believe. Yeah. Huh? Yeah, so they know for sure. The engineers are smart. I know I told you to Google, but let me Google a little bit for you and then you can Google the rest of the info later, right? Just because I love you. <laughs> so Hoover Dam generates on average about 4 billion kilowatt hours of hydroelectric power each year for use in Nevada, Arizona and California enough to serve 1.3 million people that's a lot of people and did you know people are not allowed to swim here ah if you're caught you'll be arrested and be fined and also people have committed suicide here yeah believe it or not hmm. oh my gosh also so many people like about 96 people died when they were constructing this dam yep wow guys hey some people are enjoying oh hey okay now how deep is hoover dam so the maximum water depth is 590 feet 180 meters okay so the maximum length is 112 miles that is 180 kilometers and the normal elevation is 1,219 feet, 372 meters. I hope that helps.
In 1931, the budget of constructing this dam was $49 million. Can you imagine? So put that in, in the year 2020. That is $684 million. Hey, that's a lot of money. My experience driving from Phoenix to Las Vegas you don't get to see a lot of interesting things because mostly all you see is rocks desert you know all the dry stuff but you get to see hoover dam how about that and you know what if you love quiet nice drive no worries good music then this is your kind of drive and of course with some good friends and thank you so much guys for watching this video please don't forget to like and share the video and also watch my other previous videos that i did in vegas thank you and have a wonderful day